The Academy Stadium hosted its first ever cup final on Monday night with the visit of Chelsea under 18s for the first leg of the FA Youth Cup final. Isaac Buckley started up front due to an injury to Marcus Wood and skipper Tosin Adarabayo returned to the side. Chelsea fielded a very strong team as you would expect from a side which won the UEFA Youth League at under-19's level and after just seven minutes they were ahead with an excellent touch and first-time finish from winger Tammy Abraham. First team manager Manuel Pellegrini watched on as City looked to get back into the game. Brandon Barker showed a first glimpse of what he can do as his powerful run and pass teed up Buckley who slotted the ball home with a neat finish for his second goal in this year's competition. City will be disappointed with Chelsea's second. Izzy Brown rose unchallenged to force a good save from City keeper Shettle Hogg, but the London side reacted quicker and it fell to Abraham again to make it 2-1. In truth, Chelsea dominated the first half, but the second was to be a different story. Jason Wilcox's side began to press much higher up the pitch and created a number of excellent chances. Manu Garcia went close from Barker's cutback before Aaron Nemain brilliantly nutmegged the Chelsea defender only to blast wide from the angle. The pressure continued and Keane Bryan should have scored after doing all the hard work in dispossessing skipper Charlie Colquitt, but his shot went narrowly wide of finding the top corner. After all the City endeavour, it was a real sucker punch when Chelsea got their third. Midfielder Charlie Masunda stole the ball and threaded Dominic Solanke, who was clinical with his finish and gave a side a two-goal lead to take back to Stamford Bridge next week. The result was harsh on the Young Blues, but Jason Wilcox is sure there's a lot of positives to take into the next leg. Thanks for speaking to us, Jason. What did you make of the performance tonight? I thought, uh, first half, I thought we'd give them a little bit too much respect. Um, we had a chat at half-time about having the courage to take the ball, um, stopping the holding midfield player from... Um, playing through us and I thought we did it really well I th second half performance I thought was as uh, good as we've played I think in the Youth Cup so I'm at, you know, really delighted I was really proud of them I thought we had some really um, quality players in the second half and you know unfortunately we didn't manage to score but I thought we were the only side in it second half I thought Chelsea really know that they've had a, a football match for anybody watching this game in the second half um, they should have been really proud of, of the performance from the boys because um, I certainly am. I thought, I thought we were terrific. Um, we conceded a, a late third goal, which is really disappointing because I don't think we deserved it. Um, but that's a learning curve for us moving forward. You know, uh, I was delighted with our second half. And like I say, Chelsea certainly know that they've been in a football match in the second half. It'll give us great confidence going into the second leg. By no means are we going to lie down. You know, we've got goals in our team if we keep a clean sheet and we get an early goal, then um, it will put Chelsea on the back foot.